final driver, of course, against Montpellier. Also scored against Pech Munkash in the first round. And Webb playing it short now. Back four shots over the top. He's come on in leaps and bounds, uh, taking Blackmore this season, Brian. He's had a tremendous season. Um, I mean, the manager was quoted the other day saying that he thought he was probably our best player of the season so far. And um, I wouldn't disagree with that. Plenty forward themselves now. As Dennis Irwin takes this free kick. Pallister with the header! And he won it with such ease that you feel, Brian Robson, that he'll be a constant threat to them from all the set pieces this afternoon. Yes, we're hoping that we can get something from uh, Pally and uh, Steve Bruce. It's, uh, it's just a bit unlucky. Port from McClare. Hughes has made a little break towards the near post. Nice little knock on there by Phelan to Hughes. Played now for McClare. Oh, well, it was a good save by the keeper and an excellent move by Manchester United. Yeah, it's a lovely little move. That, that's what we need. We need good, good movement round the box, little one twos, so we can get strikes on. 34 minutes gone. The big men up from the back again. And a good deep one there towards Pallister. Again, he's won it in the air, and again, he's won it in the air quite comfortably. And you get the feeling that United might well be able to capitalize on that before the end of the afternoon. You would never think they were the home side in a, a two-leg tie. But now they're coming forward as Pish. Little back pass there, and a chance now, and a goal! Brian Robson. Well, that's that's what's been happening in games like this. We've absolutely dominated the game right from the start. And it's a first situation we've had, and uh, the boys in the back of the net. Disappointing for the lads because they have played ever so well in this first half. But um, I still think there's hope for us because there's been a lot of signs there where we can score ourselves. It was Trizio who suddenly popped up the left winger on that inside right position. And Manchester United go a goal behind after dominating the first 35 minutes of the game. That's a real blow for them. And now let's see if uh, Sharp can do something about redeeming this situation. Everybody in there. Webb's in there. McClare's in there. That's it's exactly what we needed. That is brilliant. It's a exactly great Exactly the response Manchester United wanted. And Brian McClare, who scored in every round so far, has got the travelling fans jubilant now. A great reply. Webb played his part, forced home in the end by Brian McClare. Hey, we, we've deserved that there because just looking at that goal, I mean, we've just went to the goal behind it. It would have been easy for the lads to drop their heads, but we've got about five players in their box on that attack. Dominic is header. Up to Hughes. Sharp playing it on. He's again got the pace to beat Gamora, gets his cross in, just hit a little too strongly that time, but Irwin will retrieve it on the far side. Played in for Blackmore, let that go for Webb! Just past the post, the keeper's having a fair game, and uh, Webb struck that well, the keeper was down well. Rebekovic, and it's another corner for Manchester United. Lovely little step over from Clayton Blackmore there, and a great strike by Neil. Fish. Good challenge there by Donaghy. Hughes. Flag has stayed down. Hughes, a little dummy by him. Goal. Oh, Great fabulous goal. goal! Mark Hughes! What a tremendous piece of football by Mark Hughes. Absolute great tackle from Mal Donaghy to set it up. Mark's, Mark's done terrific. Well, uh, what about the dummy there? That was inside. the beauty of it. I know 
absolute riveting shot in off the post. And Manchester United go 2-1 ahead. Mark Hughes, the scorer. It was the little dummy, actually, that came in the extra yard, Brian. And what a finish. Top-class strike. An equaliser within a minute of that by Brian McClare. And then a great strike by Hughes. And Hughes now, he's onside. There's his shot. Fine save that time save. by the keeper. That was certainly goal-bound by Hughes. The keeper did well. Bonk puts it behind. Has he? No, it's a throw for Manchester United, though. Blackmore demoralized at the moment are the uh, poles Hughes falls in the box nothing given and it's back with the keeper Tremendous save from the keeper there Brian Robikovic the goalkeeper has had an excellent game been beaten twice Chizio getting it away Irwin Hughes on a rapid turn there Gets the little cross in. It's not away yet by any means. McClare's in there. Bruce is in there. It's another one. It's Steve Bruce. That amazing goal scoring record of Steve Bruce continues. That's now seven in the last six games. A real hustle in that six yard area. But Bruce finishing it off from all of four yards. If this man keeps going like this, Brian, he'll be signed by an Italian team as a striker. <laughs> it's amazing. That's 18 this season now for him. Ten of them have come from the spot. But as I say, seven now in the last six games. Uh, that's a nice goal for us, that, though, because when you dominate the game as much as this, you, you, you've got to try and get a secure lead. One minute left. Might come for Blackmore. Good save again by the keeper. Without him, United would have been five or six up by now. A beautifully struck ball again by Clayton Blackmore. And another flying save by the young reserve goalkeeper, Robikovic. Second leg, of course, live on ITV. And the final. Ballister's header, Hughes, well, that was Hughes on the volley, Brian Robson, and normally that means only one thing. I think he knew the referee would give a free kick against Gary Ballister. That's right. <laughs> you reckon? <laughs> I would think a fortnight's time is a match that you personally will look forward to greatly. There's the uh, volley over the top. Play. Ince. There goes the final whistle of this uh, first leg of the European Cup Winners' Cup semi-final. A triumph for Manchester United, who virtually put their place now in the final in Rotterdam against either Juventus or Barcelona. With Chizio having put uh, Legia ahead, McLeod Hughes and Bruce scoring the Manchester United goals. It's a joyous story that we bring you from Warsaw in Poland.